Hey there, either Holder Fire Familia, welcome to another Narjan Reacts. And this will be a reaction to The Owl House Season 2, Episode 17. So, without further ado, let's get right into it. I love how we're starting out with just immediately, like, we went from, like, the real seriousness and heavy stuff in the last episode to just pots full of tentacles with eyeballs and abomination. I don't know. You know, with this, the food that they make in this world, I'd probably starve. King, are you cooking it? This would explain a lot. Actually, wait. Wow, King. Wait, why does that actually look semi-normal? And I mean semi because you got freaking spider legs sticking out of the cake and an eyeball on the top. The most normal looking thing, to be honest, is is the purple decorated, looks like cream bun thing in the middle. I'm, you know, I'd be scared. Of it. I feel like with food from this world, don't question it, just eat it. I hope they like it too. Hurry they? Up. We have visitors. Who? They're here. Who? Who? It's free. Hold on, did we miss something here? Huh? Huh? Is this a this is a dream, right? Like, there's the, the, this place wasn't too hard to. Okay, on one side, I'm very confused, but on the other, oh, we're baby kings. <laughs> you got a little purple one. You got one that's like a little like a blue purple. Oh my god, they got purple eyes and green eyes. Wait, is this supposed to be King's dad? All right, something's already off here because we already saw like the elder, like the one that's looking for King that looks like a more adult species, of, like adult version of his species. So why, is King like a munchkin of his species or something? Like the munchkin cat or freaking teacup? <laughs> Micro? King of dads, you made it. Wouldn't have missed it for the world, son. I'm so happy we saw that video of you. They're not his family, are they? This, this for some reason reminds me a lot of um, Stuart Little, the uh, f yeah Stuart Little when his spoiler for anyone who has not seen Stuart Little, but for those of you who have, it's an old movie. So those of you, um, sorry spoilers if you have not seen it. Um, but this reminds me of when Stuart was looking for his parents and like put ads in the paper and then his parents came knocking on the door and were like, we're your mom and dad. Yay, mom and dad, you, you're alive and okay. And then it turns out, oh, they're not actually his mom and dad. They're scamming him and stuff. Is this going to be the same for King where they're not? <laughs> Yours, bro. Look at their little tails. Oh, they're so cute. Please. Even if they're not his actual family, they're freaking. Oh, look at the Echo Mouse. Well, at least, well, at least Hootie hasn't eaten the Echo Mouse. Oh. Hungy. Hungy. Oh, oh my god. Lucy's well, probably dying this She's probably like, oh my god, they're so cute. <laughs> I'm sorry. The fact that Disney never made a plushie of Baby King, or not even specifically Baby King, but just baby what, versions of his species, their marketing or whoever's in charge of that department. That opportunity went right over their head. Like, how the hell do you not sell that in plushy form? That my demon family finally got to meet my owl family. Seriously, th this is amazing. It it's almost like it's not real. A dream. A dream. <laughs> oh, it's a dream. It's been I knew it. King. King. Oh, I knew it. I knew it. <laughs> Luz is ready to talk. Oh. So, wait, this episode's called Edge of the World. Are we gonna find out more about King's family? Are we going traveling? Or are we gonna find more of... Oh, another cut intro. So we're getting more content. Witch Hunter. She draws well. Look <laughs> his face! Oh, look at her and her. She's got her cup of whatever. The plushies surrounding her and the comfort blanket. <laughs> she's 
She just needs a tub of ice cream and then she's good to go. You know what to do. Comfort. <laughs> it's only a matter of time before Bello sends his scouts over here. You need to hide. I think he already knows, doesn't he? Just from the fact that he popped up and was like, I'm tr I've am i been trying to get rid of these voices for years. I'm pretty certain he already knows. I am not hiding. Unless that was inner Bellos and he's actually that cunning and scheming on the inside that before even outer Bellos knows, inner Bellos was planning. Was he that, is he that, like, smart? <laughs> oh God, you just snapped Luce's neck. <laughs> Or crunch something. You crush some kind of bone in her. But <laughs> oh, Hootie's so happy to see Lulu. Lulu. Ugh, I'm such a fool. A dolt. A chump. A hey, no pity Idiot. parties in this house. Besides, Luce is upset enough as it is. <laughs> this is face. I love her. You're right. I'll Comfort your niece. <laughs> Be a good aunt. I'd do anything to help. Yeah. Oh my Ew. word, Moody, you gotta stop eating garbage from the ground. Huh? Oh, he spit up the letter! Yes! Oh, thank you, Lulu, for coming over, because you just made Hootie spit up the letter. Also, there's that frickin' That's where that ball went that they were kicking around. What's to say? What's to say? What's to say? Dear King Clawthorn, and maybe they're an answer to all our problems. So this is where traveling to the edge of the world. That's a very That's simple map. But I say let's go for it. Well, I say you two need a safe place to hide while the adults take care of things. <laughs> if they go on this journey, can Amity come too? <laughs> <laughs> Please, I want more Amity already. I miss her. I'm actually in favor of this plan. You, you are? are? And hmm. Emperor Bellos. What if something goes wrong? Not wrong. Hootie could accompany them. Their safety would in be his, your in responsibility. In his hoot pack. My dear, brave Hootsifer. I would protect these silly children with my life. <sighs> yeah, well, how, how would they even get there? I know a ship that might take us. Yeah, the old self. Are we bringing him back? Idama's crew. Think about it. Bellows wow, we're actually bringing them back. Okay. I wonder if I still have my sailor's hat. He's going to be like, all right, all right, all right. Then we'll go. Thank you, Ida. We won't let you down. I love how at first, when in their like first season, when Luce would hug Ida, she's like, whatever this is, stop it. Now, she like, now she's like, all right, I'll hug. <laughs> Wait for me. Oh, him and his little back. You know you. Whoever wrote that letter was sending them on a wild, loose chase. Would you stop with the dad jokes or are these becoming aunt jokes? Also, Lilith, you're the one that said that when you y'all went to go look for the thing that King was looking for on that island, you said that you'd been over there and there was no island and that he was making up and it didn't exist. And all of a sudden, oh, behold, it existed. So you've been proven wrong before. So I wouldn't exactly sit there all confidently and say... What do you mean? They, uh, yeah, they're going on the wild goose chase. That doesn't exist. <laughs> oh, no. oh. <laughs> Is it because Ida's gonna miss Luce? No, 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 no don't cry. All the two sisters. Joke wasn't that bad, was it? Oh, this is so. Adventure! Woohoo! <laughs> greener, snailier pastures. Snailier pastures. Like family to me too. Not very good family if they just left him. Uh, Is that a finger? Middle finger. <laughs> this be part of a different beastie. Is that how big king species can get? If he come back at all. I give ye to tomorrow sunset. He's so supportive. Yeah. In a half cup, cup half empty way. Is anyone here? Is this medallion gonna fit into something? Or the key, that key that I was giving to him. There's something here. You know what I find funny, and I'm sorry to bring it up into this show, but like, for any of you that watch my reactions to this series, the series that I also watch Hasman Hotel, the fact that 
this has all happened, and he's saying that was a month ago that letter happened, and I think that was back in the beginning of the season. Goes to show you how only a month, maybe two or three months have passed the entirety of the series, whereas in Hasman Hotel, we only had eight episodes, and six months passed. Like, the pacing was nyum in Hasbro Hotel compared to this. Like, this is, like, the time you need for this kind of stuff. Has been. Oh, my God, was that rushed? <laughs> but, okay, anyway. Focus on the show. Yeah, okay. It's like a, yeah, it's like a key. I thought she was actually going to have to turn. Wait a minute. That ring looked a lot like, like, looked, reminded me a lot of King's Shout. Ability, except King's shadow ability is more like a rainbow and like translucent or transparent and stuff. Whereas this is like a solid gold. I be seeing things. Whoa! Beam me up, Scotty. I love how she's like, here we go. And it's no fear. So they took a portal to another. Wolf, Don't forget the key. Okay? Where's your other arm? I only ever had two, Hootie. You think I had more? <laughs> Like, wait, why? What, who do you? You thought she's had more than two hours this whole time? The fudge? That's because it isn't. Hello. Oh, Hootie's face. You dare trespass on the sacred. <laughs> this reaction. Oh my god. This ominous was. You dare. <laughs> uh, this is Luce the human slash friend slash sister. And. Slash sister. Ah, he looks. <laughs> <laughs> What's he gonna call it, Hootie? He's gonna be like Hootie bird thing. This is Hootie, the uh, door. Your warrior ship. Wow, you just introduced him as the door. Are, are you my father? No. Alas, no. He passed down that handsome skull of yours, didn't he? <laughs> 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 I mean, I love how their skull, like their skulls mostly look the same. So the fact he's like, he passed down a, a handsome skull of yours. You. Everyone? Who's everyone? How many? Is it a whole town? Welcome. This is like freaking Poe from Kung Fu Panda finding out he's not the last panda alive. To Titan Chopper Island. Titan Trapper. Titan Trapper Island. Do they trap Titans? So are there more than just one Titan? If they could trap Titans. Oh, what powers can King have? Like, if this Titan, if the Titan on the Boiling Isles comes alive or whatever it is, does that mean he has the power to, or they all have the power to possibly restrain it? Ooh. Also, all their huts look like freaking Koopa shells. The spiky Koopa shell. Oh my god, so many kings. So they're like the demon hunters, but instead they're, they're, they're Titan hunters. Not many of us have seen a live one, of course. <laughs> so you have no experience in finding him. The Grand Huntsman says one remains. So we sharpen our spears until the vile one creature remains. rears its head. Is that the day you use? Are they going to bring back a titan? Or are they going to bring back that one living titan? And you can join us and become a titan trapper yourself. Boy, Isn't he a little young? Any enemy of yours is an enemy of ours. Hurrah! Yay! The wisest hunter of them all, Bill. Bill? <gasps> is that Bill? short for something? Nope, just Bill. He's so cool. It's no big deal. Whoa. This big, strong, freaking demon looking, elder looking thing. And he's like sitting there going, Oh, we're best friends, you know, friends. <laughs> And dangerous. They're my ways too. How about Is this gonna be like a goodbye butterfree episode? It better not be. I hope you learn all you can about being a Titan trapper. The sparkles in his eyes. He should have time to get to know his family. I, he's with his kind. He'll be fine. I think. Ready to become a Titan trapper? He's gonna regret this. I don't know. I feel like it's gonna be like really like hard training. A uh, pinata? Is this literally gonna be like Kung Fu Panda where frickin' Poe like expected them all to be warriors but then they turned out to not know a darn thing? And then he had to teach them. Even though King doesn't really know how to fight either. I wonder, do they not know their own powers? Like that shout ability, like do they not know? 
Is King gonna teach them? What's this Karate Kid? Oh. Wait, why did he change color? Is it to show that he's hot? Because of the boiling water? Or is it just... Oh! No, not the Pigeon Griffin! Oh, okay, it's okay. Okay, so they know their abilities, so never mind. Look how small he is. But how does this prepare him to fight a Titan? Tell Bill I said hi. Tell Bill I said hi. Hello? What is Bill gonna look like? Whoa. Look at all this stuff. Why does that dagger on the wall kind of look like the one that Bellos used to kill the Grimwalkers? Hootie? This will help us to beat Bellos for sure. Okay. Oh, yeah. What is that? Is that you? <laughs> what was Hootie's face? What was that? Fa <laughs> That's such a disappointing like. Mm. Stop rummaging. The last time a study of the boiling owls, Flora Desplora. Wait, Flora Desplora. Is that written by what's her name? The one that taught Lilith. My stuff. Not Why does this one sound like freaking uh King? <clears throat> The way Hootie just bowed, he's just like, ow! Never mind. <laughs> ow! Anyway, before I hit my head on anything else. Lowly traveler begs an audience. I love how she changes the way she speaks. With the great Bill. And mayhaps. I'm sorry, the fact that his name is Bill, if he's voiced by freaking Alex Hirsch, who voiced Bill from Gravity Falls. <laughs> we might perchance to venture. She just sticks her head in her. I'm here to ask if you would lend me your mighty warriors. See, Emperor Bellows has He's gonna laugh and go, Mighty! Pfft, they're not mighty. I've got battle scars older than his reign as Emperor. Wanna see? Okay, good. Wait, wait. So that's what they look like underneath? Wait, he has no fur. The last living titan. I saw it once. Before it disappeared, a hateful roar blew out my eardrums. How did it go? Whack! The great way. You know what? I'm still like, I thought of the idea of I want to make a t-shirt that's called the Great Weckoning. <laughs> the more I hear this, <laughs> Really seriously, make a shirt of that. The huntsman wants us to find the last one. Only a titan's power can free him from his prison. But we've had no luck. Is that what the day of unity is? Is that to release the last titan? Grand huntsman cannot return to us until the lost son is found by someone worthy. Oh, it's more like a mural. Why are there so many dead king? The collector. The the the. Does the collector collect their skulls? Ah, you found the shrine to the huntsman. It's been my little the huntsman's the collector. You like our disguises? You gotta look like a titan to trap one. But if I ever find that miss. Hey, is King Species Titan? Is King the last Titan? <laughs> no, I just, I've just had my mind blown. There is no way. Because they're talking about the last son. So they think King is not the actual son. Or is this a trap? Is King like the... I, 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 I... Oh my god, none of them. Oh my god. None of them are freaking so King Species is a Titan? He's the last That's why it sounded so that's why the key was so big. To the doorway to the the place, the shrine, whatever the place the king was dropped into. That's why the keyhole was so big, because they were tight. So when they the parent dropped over dropped the king's egg onto the nest, that's why it was so big. Is there? Oh my god! It was probably running from the hunters, and it. Oh my god! <laughs> that's exactly. How, 
That's what had, this had to be the Phantom's reaction, right? This is so like it's just like <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> this has all been super cool, but I gotta go check out. And super uh shocking, but um that means they're all wearing the skulls of the Titans they've killed. Wait, we know how big Titans get. Are all these skulls that are small like baby Titans? Oh my god. Okay, bye. Oh, we gotta get King out of here now. Run faster. Oh my god, when he said that all he remembers is the cry of wah. King, stop saying wah. This is the one time I'll ask and beg, please do not say wah. Stop! Where? Stop! The fact that, how did I not see this? Like, of course, it's weird. Why are they using the skulls of King's kind as freaking decoration in like armor? Like, oh, the fur, they're wearing their fur, their claw. Ew. But a Titan Trapper is never alone. So he thinks King is a baby hunter and they lost his father to a Titan. Oh my God. I'm just happy to see he passed down this. And when he says pass down the Oh my god, that is such smart like writing and stuff. That we say you're going, oh yeah, I passed down the skull, you know, because we think, oh, he inherited the skull from his father. Oh no. What he's talking about is that his father was a hunter and, and that king inherited the skull that his father of the Titan that the, his father killed. Can we play catch? I believe you may I wonder is Tarek gonna feel connection to King and not want to kill him because he sees that he's just like a child that wants a father. They find some equipment thither. <gasps> thither? Thither. <laughs> the time has come to celebrate your uh, induction into the Titan Trappers. Is he gonna? What I feel like Tarek is not gonna go through with it. I have to go all out like this. I I'm fine doing a small thing. Um, family and friends kind of thing. Family and friends. This is like a marriage. That's the medallion that Bellos had. What's interesting is Bellos is not connected to them, but Bellos. Wait. Are there two separate collectors? Is there a collector that they've got, but then there's a collector that Bellos has got, or is it the same collector? Because if there's two different ways to get for the collector to be freed, why would the collector go through freaking Bellows if they could have? I. Mm. And set it ah, uh, Luz, we really need you right now. Don't worry, child. We're almost done. Then we get to play. Hey! No! Luz! Uh, did you pull something, Bill? I can't move. Whoa. This? Oh, invisible? She's invisible? What's happening? Is she holding her breath this whole time? God, they suck, monster. Suck, monster. I just thought I had to prepare for a world without you in it. <laughs> Don't do this. Not right now. I'm good. Hey, well, then what am I? You're Titan. You're a Titan, King. Fuck. I'd be like, damn, I'm a Titan. Oh, hell yeah, I'm better than even a regular demon. <laughs> okay. Well, so much for Tarek being good. Who did just fly? Oh, who is blocking their shots? Eat light, sucker. Who Can we not pull a freaking, um,. What is that art, that military movie? Was it Shawshank Redemption? Um, I don't know what movie it was. It was where one of them gave their life for the other, but let's, let's do that, please. King, we need your win now. The Grand Huntsman will return and I shall ride. That's not horrifying at all to see a bunch of people wearing the skulls of your kind. <laughs> um. You mean we, right? You probably. <laughs> the spirit's like, you mean us, right? Right? Promise the huntsman who grant all of us glory. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you know, okay, you know what? Bill is a lot like 
Oh, gee, look at that. Both of them stand have B's as their starting letter. Yeah, Bill and Bellos. They're both guys that want power for themselves. Isn't that interesting? Uh, and they're both working with the collector. Titans even evil? How much have you been making up? Are Titans even evil? <laughs> oh, just, you know what? Oh, look at that. Bills made the Titans seem evil to them, so then they would hunt and go and do all that. Bellos has made the wild magic seem evil. Yeah, okay. Uh, I'm totally not lying. Hand me my spear. You have one tooth? Whatever. Just give me that thing. Never mind. You have a spear. Go, Hootie! Run away, run away, run away. Use this crystal. Bye-bye. Oh, no. Perfect way. Bye! Got you know what? I was gonna ask how long is Hootie, but never mind. I've learned not to ask with Hootie. There, there is no end to Hootie. I got it, you guys. <laughs> I know. Where? The great where? 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 Big shout. Big where? Holy. <laughs> Go King! The who of uh, the great who shield. Poor King, though. He just wants a family. He's the last of his kind. I want to go home. To find out he's the last of his kind, probably. Jesus. We're gonna go back to that island with the key, aren't we, though? Um. Could the Titan be his dad? Or parent? Or his relative? You want breakfast? <laughs> Bacon and eggs. Oh my god, actual normal looking food. Scratch it. I'm 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 boarding this ship and I'm staying with this captain. He he cooks normal food. Uh oh, they're gonna go after the howl house, aren't we? Wait a minute now. Mm-mm. 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 I saw that guard. There. There you are. Mr. and Mrs. Pointy Hat. And you're Linky. Who are you? Who who are you? You stand out for a reason, and I, we saw you before. Are you gonna turn your are you gonna like Ugh, Kiki Mara? Is that how we're ending this episode? Also, wait, I want to see the voices of Tarek. Kevin Michael Richardson. Okay, I know his voice, but I don't recognize the name. God, so... But Tarek... You know, I always thought it was interesting how King's helmet looks a lot like the Titan's head. But I thought maybe it was a different species, like he... Because he's so small. Like, the fact they can get that big, I'm thinking, okay, there's no way they start out that tiny, right? But then again, now that I think about it, look at pandas. They start out to be, like, this tiny. And then you see that the size they grow into. So, it's definitely very possible. Oh, my God. It's literally been staring at our faces this entire time. Was that a known thing in the fandom? Like, did the fandom guess that? Because that... That... I suspected it like way early on, but then I, as it, the series went on, I was like, nah, okay, that's probably a different species of demon that's like, and it's a, a class of its own, and King's not like a part of it, but the fact King's a baby one of them. Oh my god. Oh my god, and he's the last one. Oh, nah. Ah. Ah, all right, let me, let me get into my thoughts. Alrighty, holy. Okay, this episode. God, this bombshell after bombshell with these 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 last, last two episodes. Holy, you had the one with Bellos and Hunter in the previous, or the Grimwalkers in the previous one, and now I got this one for King and the fact that he's a tiny. Oh my God, I heavy hitters, Jesus. Uh, okay. Um, yeah. I mean, well, we got finally got the answer that King, what King specifically is, but whole it's the last one. I feel so bad for King. Like he keeps thinking he's found his family and stuff. And the first time was that he had hope. It was like, oh, so my parent, my father, left me to protect me, kind of thing. But then, um, you know, he could still be alive. And then you get that hope of, oh my God, it's his family and stuff. And then you find out, oh no, they're actually hunters that killed his kind, and they're wearing his skulls. That is so, ugh. 
That is so. <laughs> oh my god. I want to hug King so bad. Like, okay, don't be wrong. I want to hug. I want to hug. Did I say hung? I want to hug King, Loose, and Hunter. Those three need the hugs. Hugs the most right now. Oh my god. But uh, yeah. All right. Plot for this episode, great. Character is great. Um, I wonder if those hunters. I mean, they've been sealed off now into that world or wherever they were. So that makes me wonder. I don't think they're going to be brought back. But I'm still curious about that collector they were going to, um, like, release. I feel like it's a different collector. Because there's no way the same collectors working with Bellows would have two different ways to escape. But then we don't see it, like, working with them? Unless, like, I don't, I, I, yeah, I don't know. But now that... Is that even going to come into play later on, considering they've been sealed off? So, like, I don't think it is, but who knows? But, um, yeah. Anyway, um, it's a shame. Actually, it's, it's a shame that Tarek didn't turn out to, like, I thought because that him and King kind of had bonding moments that I thought maybe he would kind of feel bad for trying to kill King and maybe think to himself, maybe these times are as bad as uh, Bill made him out to be. But the fact he just went right there, yeah, kill him all. It's like, okay, never mind. Terry's bad. Um, but, uh, yeah. Um, plot was great for this episode. Characters are great. Animation was great. Um, music was great. All around great episode. I feel like I feel like the last episodes of this series are going to be bangers after bangers. I, I, I don't think we're going to have any more filler or whatever episodes, like, lighthearted. I feel like we're not because, like, we got a week until the day of Unity. Stuff is ramping up. I could see possibly maybe one episode that's gonna be like possibly lighthearted, but other than that, I can't see there being more because stuff's getting serious. And I can't see them wrapping up what's going on in the day unity within I don't know how many episodes are left. This is episode 17. I think there's 23 total for this season. So that's only six episodes. There's no way they have a lighthearted episode, and that leaves us with only five episodes left to get like to deal with the Day of Unity and all that stuff that's going to go down. Um, but then again, there's also three episodes for season three, so maybe that has to do with it. Or it's a epilogue kind of thing. I don't know. I don't know. I haven't looked into it, and I'm not going to. But I'm um, interested to see how this progresses forward. If it's going to be just a, a snowball effect from here on out, or if it's, we're going to get a brief like break from it for one episode, like the next one or the one after that, and then it's just all shit going down um but anyway yeah those are my thoughts for this episode i hope you enjoy this reaction if you like early access to my full and edit reactions go join my patreon i'll be putting the link right out here um but yeah uh i hope you have a wonderful morning after night and keep bringing bright see ya